Oh, poor Squint. Ever since Squint was a baby, she had trouble standing on her webby feet. She'd wobble and sway and tumble over. Could I get a hand, please? Squint knew something was wrong. Why couldn't she stand without falling? When Olivia met Squint, she could see that someday she'd be the silliest, loudest, happiest goose around. Someone just had to give Squint a chance. At home, Olivia watched Squint closely. Squint could stand for a little while, but if she leaned too far forward, she'd tumble onto her back. I'm okay. At night, she'd sleep with her head like this. And she had trouble keeping up with her friends. It's okay. Try again. You got it. Olivia saw that Squint was frustrated too. Why'd she keep falling over? Soon, Squint's vet figured out why. There was something wrong with Squint's long goose neck. So Olivia made Squint a tiny little neck brace out of soft foam. Put it on Squint and... It kinda worked. Hey, still on my feet. With the brace holding Squint's neck, she could do more than just stand. She could walk and run. She could finally keep up with her friends. And then something really great happened. Her neck got better. She could lean all the way forward without falling over. Whoops! Well, sometimes she still fell over. I'm okay. It took practice and patience and a best friend to help her, but Squint never gave up. And now, look at Squint. Look at me. She's the queen of the yard who swings her neck to squawk at all the other geese. Excuse me, does anyone want to hear me honk? I can honk so loud. Her neck still bends back a bit, but when it does, Olivia just pushes it. Hey, could you give me a little hand here? You got it. Olivia is Squint's favorite person. She gives her a hug whenever she can and likes to mess with her shoes. Oh, your shoelace is untied. Weird, how did that happen? <laughs> In other words, she makes Squint happy and gave her the chance she needed to be the silliest, loudest goose. A queen goose in a neck brace. Dolo Kids! Help the kittens find the subscribe button.